Hello everyone, today I want to take a look, or a quick look rather, show you a quick look at uh, my little V-Jeweled engine that I've been working on. It's a really simple sample right now, uh, but I'll go over it real quickly with you guys and show you what you can do in Visual Basic.net. Uh, it's a really simple game. Uh, so basically we have, we click on that block, and then we click on this block and we'll get a valid move. Well, if we click on this one, and we click down here, it's a valid move. Or if we click right here and click right there, then it's not valid. Um, so what it's doing here, though, is I'm building a grid. Uh, and based on my row or my column, it'll count over to either this way or count down to or even count backwards to uh, to see if I've made a valid move. So let's say if I wanted to click there and then I click here, obviously an invalid move. But if I click here and I click here, I'm going to get a valid move. So it's a really simple math equation, basically what it's working out. You know, it's just checking those values uh, based on the the row uh, for that object or the column, depending on if it's checking a row or column. What you can do with this, uh, you can do the traditional drop down method where your blocks would fall what I plan on doing though is I plan on just having it generate a new object or a new item or image or whatever it may be um, and then generate some points when I finish building this right now I'm having some minor issues and I'll go ahead and show you like say we click right here come over to come down to and click right there it's giving me a valid move so that's just a really simple uh, problem I've got to solve with the math to see what's going on um, why or why not you know, that's working and why it's not working well technically it's not working but you know what I mean so so got to solve that problem I'm sure it'll take you know super easy to do what I also plan on doing is when you click I plan on drawing a box as you can see here in my my comments to do draw a box so what I want to do here is just draw a red box outlining uh, wherever we're at just to indicate to the player that you know they've selected that box or they've highlighted you know that grid that portion of the grid all right so that's my Vjeweled engine it's written in visual basic uh, dot net using 2010 visual studio uh, post your comments let me know what you guys think